Welcome back one and all to the Brexit Estate, hard by the darkest dungeon where I'm just checking I actually remember to press record. Okay, we got a little bit of money now, things are starting to look up, let's try and improve things. What do we want? More Vestals. When do we want them? As soon as we can get them. But poor sister Wendy is traumatizing in a very bad way and that is actually quite a nice perk for her to have. Sort of. But let's see, that's a lot of stress, that's a lot of hassle. Could we get... Oh, blight resistance low. Yeah, I mean, yeah, those aren't really... I mean, that's a bit of an issue, but quite understandable given her affliction with the Crimson Curse. However, that is a massive amount of stress. Let us send her to pray. And hopefully she won't feel too guilty. Now, after our last week, we have basically a very nice time if we go to the Warrants. What's available in the Warrants? Mid-level with oh, bumper crop and... Okay, that's kind of tempting. High... Yeah, we can't do high. Um, if we went low, how many low-level characters have we got now? Just one. Okay. So if we went mid we'd be taking a lot of afflicted characters and oh god this is gonna be a horrible week isn't it i just know it right Ugh. you know we do have the money so Rexum, it's time you improved that skill If we're camping as well, we could take someone with a safe camping skill. Oh, but then we'd run the risk of the... yeah. That's not fun. Okay, so who would our other mid-level characters be? It'd be Kelly, Malcolm, Galliard, Amira, Nenya, uh, Jamila, Ulcina Vane, and that is it for low-level characters. Well, for mid-level characters. Oh! And I did say Stanford was going to get a reward. Asuro Steel has produced two marvellous new skins for the Highwayman. Including this gorgeous one that I'm using here for Stanford. I think he's earned it well. And we'll look forward to seeing it in the near future. It's, uh, it's pretty funky, I must say. He looks like uh, an old exorcist. Or kind of... Um, Oh, uh, you know, Abraham Van Helsing from the Dracula novel, the old man. Not not the new Helsing film where he goes around shooting things with a crossbow as some young guy and it's like, what? Nah. Okay. So, let's say we are trying to form a party. This would then be it. We would have Three crimson cursed people, and oh my god, that would be a lot of flesh, um, stress. We don't want you doing that. Okay. And you are a kind of support role. You are. You'd be really good if we had a marking. or some kind of safe camp skill. We have a safe camp skill. If we go in and camp, we might still be able to make it out in good condition. Right, our heroes have been chosen, our quest has been chosen. Let's get some hero upgrades, because we probably need some. Look, when it comes to healers, we got these two. And it's not exactly their speciality. <laughs> Wrexham, you're going to be under-leveled. We need you to at least be able to land the odd hit. So, Galliard, you're in bloody good condition, actually. Right. So, Wrexham, we will upgrade your gear. And then, let's go take a look in here. Oh, yeah. Some people have the Crimson Curse. That's not a lot of fun, is it? Okay, um, that could go, to be honest. Yeah, let's do that. 
diurnal. Well, he's likely to be a Reynold and in high light conditions most of the time anyway, so that's less of an issue. Those are all expensive ones to cure, but Dud Hitter could be rather serious. Actually, so is that. Rel could easily remove that, to be honest. Ludovic. <coughs> yeah, those aren't good. Rosnav. You know what? I'm thinking that could actually be... Ooh, okay. And and we lost, uh, not Ren, but our other um, highly experienced Twilight Knight. It was most disappointing. So Sophie... Ugh, so many greedy heroes. Okay, well at least that would be cheap to fix. You know what, Stanford? You have earned a reward, especially as you're going to be going out next week, whatever happens. Come what may. Oh, no diseases to cure. Malcolm, that's a lot of... Oh, God. We can't send you there because we're using this. We can send you here, though. And you can drink your sorrows away, old soldier. You've earned a rest. All right. Now, going to the Warrens. We're going to want damn good tr Warrens trinkets. Dodge is good, debuff resist minus dodge. We don't need that for her. Okay, we give her a debuff skill chance. Yeah, that's uh, that's all good. Yep, yeah, go with that. And you, my fine friend, just get those. Okay, do we have anything better? Uh, not really. And again... And you get both those. His health isn't going to be above 60% very much, is it? Because of the limited healing capabilities of the other heroes. But we'll do what we can. Okay, we're going to want lots and lots and lots of food. Do we have someone who eats even more food? Or even less food? I don't see any... That's really tempting to try and keep, actually, for a leper. But he really needs accuracy and crit chance. Right, we're going to take some extra food because we have not a lot of healing. Right, it's for Warrens, we need lots and lots of bandages, especially as we have a leper. We're gonna want lots of these, a few of those, um, not so many of those, two, three, four. And we're gonna have to, I mean, look, we're probably gonna end up running into the Fanatic on this run. If we get lucky and complete the quest without meeting him, that's brilliant. Uh, shovels. I'm so glad I remembered shovels. Isn't that nice? Right, and then we need to take our antiquarian and start using these supply items to free up slots for treasure. No fanatic? I'm impressed. Maybe this will be an okay run after all. I mean, I doubt it. We're probably going to be getting a resolve test or two shortly after entering. And in we go. Even the fiercest beast will lay down when it is not eaten. Steal their food. <laughs> well, we got a nice and simple path ahead of us for the first couple of you. You are our designated Kuro Interactor. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. You know what? We came with equipment. We shall use the equipment. And in we go. 
All right, so Galliard, we're counting on you to carry this sorry lot of sods. Do we get a scouting check? We do! Wonderful! Did I forget to... I did. Damn it. Well, I'm going to hope for a key. Because you never can tell. And I completely forgot to bring torches. Well, this is going to be an interesting quest. Fortunately, Sir Galliard has Bulwark of Faith and Inspiring Cry hotkeyed, so he's probably going to be using those quite a lot. <laughs> wow. And then we'll also camp for Firelight at one point. We'll dig our way through this. Are unsurprising. These tunnels predate even the earliest settlers. Right, our two goals are to keep Nenya and Sir Rexham alive. And Sir Galliard. Basically anyone who's not a mirror. But why? That's not very good. Get in there, girl. Yeah, find that treasure. Do it. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. You know, when she turns up results like this, I think my trying to keep her alive is also kind of guaranteed oh bugger sir Wrexham why did you do that uh oh that's good that's good continue the relentless advance uh could you by any chance just shoot him lovely I almost feel like oh bugger here we go here we go, here comes all the stress and horror. And you need to not be so accurate. Nice. We need the light! Light has ever been the hope of men, so get you gone! Hands up, anyone who recognized that misquote. What is it? But nevertheless, light has ever been the hope of men, so something, something... It, you know, it's Aragorn speaking to the Uruk High at the gates of Isengard, and bugger me, I think she can reach. Yep. And bang! Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Okay, that's a very bad number. I... Hmm, I didn't need that, did I? Well, you better strike at it. Nicely done, sir. It's gonna mess you up now. Ooh, nice. That's very good. If you could just skip back to there, that'd be lovely. And if you could shoot it. Also lovely. And hack away. Thank you for not getting the kill. As we will now raise the light level somewhat. Nice. Alright, now we kill. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. That's a nice amount of emeralds. That is a very nice amount of emeralds. Oh lovely. We need this. And it's eating into our supply space. You need this. You need this. You need this. You know what? That's much better. Oh, ah, two stress clauses in the swine tour. Well, do your duty, Sir Exum. Calm the fuck down. <laughs> Uh, hello everybody, they're gonna try and kill us, like protect yourselves and everything. I like this fight music track, especially when it gets darker and louder. <laughs> Please excuse me while I bob my head in time to the music. Let the light shine! Ugh, the dreaded trot retreat. Because of what follows. Mm. 
Murder kill death main. Nope. Useless. Hello. I got a knife. That's not a knife, says Sir Wrexham. <laughs> this is a sword. Alright. 79, yeah, sure. Working that stress down 12 at a time. Not 11. Uh oh. Don't get knocked back! You got knocked back. And stunned. Oh, the horror. The hot. Aha! We can debuff your attacks and remove some stress. Ugh. Uh oh. Uh oh. No! It was all going so well! At any cost. Except it wasn't. We got keys. Why did I think I didn't have keys? Uh oh. Uh oh. And trot retreat! Yeah! Now we're going to have rather a lot of stress to deal with. You know what? We just need to debuff your accuracy even more. Thank you very much. Uh oh. Wow, that's good. Uh, I need you to try and shoot him, but the big one will do. The blood quickens. I've got to say, I'm looking forward to assembling my leper miniature soon, but I'd really like a swine tour miniature, to be honest. That'd be amazing. Just get that painted up on a tabletop, terrify some poor, unsuspecting players. <laughs> and we'll try and kill this thing. Nice! If you could get knocked back and hit, that would be lovely. Not for the being hit part, but for being knocked back part. You know what? Just get behind him. Yeah. Right. There we go. Working it down. Mate, you don't need a horse. You just need to calm down. Find that sense of resignation. That inner resolution. That acceptance of the unpleasant, and wow, that hit her hard. She was, however, fortunately not knocked back. However... What? Alright. Be like that, then. Not doing yourself any favours, you know. In fact, one could almost say... You've got a bit of a death wish. Speaking of death wish... Let's try and at least get somewhere nearer to a death. You know, I'd, I'd love to, I'd, I'd love to, but I just need to kind of go like this. There we go. Now, if you could not fuse this, that would be superb. I'm very much obliged. The recovery is real. Speaking of recovery... It very much must be done. And we strike. Awesome. Uh oh. Don't get knocked back and stunned. Thank you. Uh oh, that's bad. That's very bad. She needs to guzzle some of this stuff that is not Cherry Cola. Or Dr. Pepper. Or anything else like that and give him a nice little nick with the tip of that blade. You! Do it! Alright, so we're down to about six stress removal skills from him in the future. But for now, that's just way more stress than she needs. Nice! Now we're just going for a straight kill. Oh, it's one painting, it could be much worse. Let's... No, 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 we're just going to camp. A moment of respite. A chance to steel oneself against the coming horrors. Now, Sir Galliard, do your duty. Perfect. Right, now...
Yes. That actually worked quite nicely. Um, you know, we are in the Warrens. And he's in a really bad mood, unfortunately. Oh well, at least we didn't get an ambush. Please, please in don't kiss. May we find victory. Please don't kiss whoever packed the food, Sir Wrexham. You've got leprosy. They they probably don't want you near their face. It's nothing personal. It's well, it's very personal actually. They're just really intolerant, you know. And and wow. Um, right. Okay. Uh, could you maybe just like ditch that for that? That's great. And um, these stack in freeze. You know what? I'm leaving that one. I'm leaving them. And going for that secret room via a rather roundabout way. We come round at it that way. Because we need to eat some food and we don't have any torches and we just got rid of our anti-venom so this is going to be fun you know what needs to be done and that was not it right bang nice even nicer and the web please don't get you got stunned why do you always get stunned everybody we need more stun resistance traits and trinkets and quirks and perks and a knife Okay. Well, since this is becoming a somewhat darker run than I expected. Give them no quarter. That is a common 750. If only I could remember the values of... You don't let me... You... you blah, blah. Well, now you can use that bandage I wanted you to use in the first place. Because it starts to make room for more treasure. There are mods that cause quest objective items to stack. I may have to look into getting some of those. But for now though, we're just all oh good, another fight. This opens up opportunities. Not that kind though. Right. Executed with impunity. Perfect. If we can kill them all in one round, that'd be pretty amazing. Uh oh. You wait. What? Yeah, all right. I understand. I was kind of hoping. Oh, it lives. <laughs> that was very lucky. And shoot it anyway. You know, I'm really tempted to ditch those bandits for port bandages for portraits, but I won't because there's a secret room full of treasure up ahead that we will be visiting. There's also a fu- That was a rubbish fight! Right, you get back there. Uh-oh. Oh, if only we'd kept Holy Lance equipped. Alright, you know they're gonna hit you. Just be tough, man. Ah! Actually, this works out quite nicely because she can just slip back to there and we've returned to our original formation. And yet the pain is quite real. Okay, there will be healing. Evidently. Lots of healing. No, no, don't pop. You passed. The narrator is awfully quiet at the moment as we're suffering in agony here. Oh, good God. Right, yeah, well, we're just going to do this.
and this. And this, because it also improves the light level. And there we go. Ooh, nice dodges, everyone. Our leper may be removing his affliction yet. I say may. Right, two for two, four for four. Four for four is really bad. You need to get shot at quite successfully too. You, on the other hand, need to be removing some of your personal stress and taking it down to 20. Nice. Alright, this will knock off 9, 2 9s are 18, they are not 20, and we do need the light. Oh, didn't quite get him. Right, that's bad. Uh oh. No! Get back there, you ninny! I was lucky. Uh oh. He that's actually what I wanted him to do, so I'm not going to complain. But we do have lots and lots of stress. 114, 130, 131 is a lot. Right, we try for this kill. In about two rounds time, because he won't kill the bodies. But he can kill the bodies. Like so. And then regarding this thing, we shall attempt to kill it with violence. Violence and bullets. But also we will do some healing, because she is really shockingly unhealthy at the moment. Yep, that's fine, just shoot it please. And miss, that's delightful. She's going to take stress from this, isn't she? No, just flight. Okay, awesome. And kill please. Alright, what do we do? We eat some food. We do this in the interest of who needs this. You need this. Um, drink it. Drink up, man. It's disgusting and revolting and stuff it. We just haven't been taking the bleeds this run at all. Right. Well, that was dumb, wasn't it? You might ask why that was dumb, because we have to pick this up. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Well, there we go. Kira quest. Oh well, in that case. Here we go, walking down the hallway, everyone wants to eat, that's fine. That is so very fine, now we're just going to go to this secret room, uh, crawl through this grate here. A mirror, if you would do the honours of this key, that would be superb. Oh look, lots of knots and lots of marvellous treasures. And then we'll double back this way and complete our quest. I'm quite pleased with the way this run's turning out so far. Watch as like the collector ambushes us right now. Right now. Not quite the collector. But you know what? I'll take it. That's pretty damn good. And second courier along should be exactly what we're after. Hello? Right. I need you to eat this. 
you get to eat this, and you know what, you get to eat a bit as well. And there we go. Our duty done, we return to town because we are out of food and we forgot to bring torches. Not a bad run overall. Our supplies are replenished. The soldiers will feast tonight. Apart from me obviously neglecting to bring torches and accidentally doing a dark run. Because it's four in the morning and I haven't really slept yet. Well, four thirty, but yeah, anyway. Uh nice, so we actually got about thirty grand out of that, that's good. Also got a nice lot of heirlooms, and so Galliard has now hit fifth. Clutch hitter. You know the leper has a lot of health, so getting him down below 50 might always be good, and also it wouldn't synergize well with his class trinkets of having above 60% health. However, it would give him a duality where he would be good in both situations. Replaced quick draw. Mm, first round. It's not really any good after the first round. Wheel Tactician replaces Skilled Gambler. And she's got the ague, so she's going to need to go to hospital. Or l'hôpital, as the French would say. A modest offering from those few surrounding farms as yet untouched by the spreading calamity. Nearby farmers have banded together, increasing security in an effort to protect the healthy livestock and crops on which the hamlet depends. Supply costs minus 100%, provisions costs minus 100%. We get completely free supplies and provisions on our next week. Going into our next quest. That is amazing. And this might actually be the highest amount of money we've had in the estate this entire campaign. Malcolm has become an alcoholic. But at least he's not irrational anymore. Some would argue that being an alcoholic can make someone quite irrational. Um, yep, Stanford will be going on our next quest. Sister Wendy has removed a lot of stress, that's all good. Reynolds has had that quirk removed. He's no longer scared of evil tentacle monsters from the great beyond. Many people suffering from a crimson curse. And do we have anyone nice in the stagecoach, like another Vestal, perchance? Preferably higher than starting level. No, no Vestal this week. Oh dear. You know, that wasn't a bad week. That turned out quite nicely. I'm quite pleased. We got um, 88, uh, 28. This isn't really... We need more busts. The portraits aren't going to get us much because we've finished the tavern. And have we finished the guild? We have. So the only thing we need portraits now for is districts. And we're going to need at least a hundred of them. I would like to build the Altar of Light. I'm still disturbed that one of the mid-level bosses didn't give us a district plan. I wonder if events that give us district plans are reduced from... or if it's just a chance to drop, but it's still annoying. Because it means I might not now be able to build all of them. Which obviously means the Red Hook comes last, because it doesn't actually do anything. Okay, let's have a look. 300 miles away. 200... Not too far off, actually. Uh, yeah, not happening anytime soon with either of these. Another 300. So basically, the only one we got a chance of in the near ish future would be the Puppet Theatre, which would actually be really nice to build. It'd give everyone. Uh, right, it's not increased. No, it's increased by 10 per week, not increased to 10 per week. So that's going from 5 stress reduction a week to 15 stress reduction a week. That's quite impressive. And obviously, for our next week. I will be sending out Sister Wendy and Stamford. Where are you? There you are. And I uh, hope you'll enjoy it. You know what? I'll um, I'll put a link to Stamford's mod either in a sticky comment or in the description of the episode itself. But for now, I need to stop recording and start getting this one uploaded. I trust you will enjoyed it, and I'll see you all in the next one. I'll say bye bye for now and cheerio.